Well, the first cyclone of the year is bearing down on the WA coast this evening. Broome is on yellow alert right now as Cyclone Blake is set to pass the town tomorrow morning. Today, locals stocked up on supplies and bunkered down. The system will bring gale force winds and up to 200 millimetres of rain in the next 24 hours certainly capable of producing some damage uh, that will lead to destruction of property, uh, trees coming down and the big issue here when you have those wind strengths is that any loose articles can be picked up and thrown around as, de as uh, flying missiles basically. Let's go straight to Sherry Lee Biggs now who is tracking this cyclone tonight. Sherry, the system could crash into our coast uh, as early as tomorrow. Yes, well, it's currently sitting just 150 kilometres off the coast of Broome right now, Michael, and the longer it stays over water, the stronger the system will grow. Tonight, we can expect it to travel south adjacent to the coast. Wind gusts over 100 kilometres an hour already recorded at Broome Port today. It is expected, expected to strengthen into a Category 2 system tomorrow afternoon and is likely to make landfall around Wallal Downs and uh, along 80 Mile Beach late tomorrow night or early Wednesday morning. At that strength, Blake could pack winds of 125 kilometres an hour from an area between Beagle Bay and Bidjadanga, including Broome. Daily rainfall totals predicted to sit between 100 and 150 millimetres, with some isolated falls of 250 millimetres is possible. Now, that has prompted flood warnings and road closures around the West Kimberley coastal catchment. And, Michael, it's just the beginning of what could be a wild week of weather uh, in our north, but there is a second system brewing as well around the Northern Territory. So I'll have all the details on what's to expect uh, coming up later in the bulletin. Looking forward to it, Shirley Biggs. We'll talk then.